pretty much almost every single play. And talk about how your freshman year has evolved and, and how you feel you've gotten better. This has been going awesome. I started off from scout team, just progressing my way through practice and just working hard with urgency and just getting better through practice each and every day. And I just bumped up, kept bumping up. So how are you this game? Yeah. yeah. After the first play, the GD Buzz was going. I was all right. And I just continued to do what we do in practice. It was a lot slower than it was in practice. So it just came right along. Sick, though, did you? No, man. How did the interception feel? Felt great. It, it, I was very urgent, just the plays that coaches put in is designed for us to make plays and just be urgent to the ball and you do what the coach say, it's going to fall in your hands. So what's that play when you step in front of the receiver? Do you see something there? What about his duties? How do you do yeah. that? Well, my, ran, my man ran an over route and I was a man and the quarterback was scrambled. I just kept urgent, ch kept chasing my man the ball in my hands. Anything else? You, you've become more physical as the years gone, as the season's gone through. Uh, talk a little bit about that. Um, just just like progressing through practice, we do individual jobs and getting better each and every day. I came in the summer, just progressing from the summer and now, I can say I became a better person, but I still have more effort to put in and more time to work and become an even greater person. Guys, uh, next week is senior day, and it's the last regular season game. How important is it for you to you know, have a good showing for the, for the veterans who will be leaving? Uh, it's a really, it's a big deal to me, you know, just coming in and getting to meet those guys. And they're such great guys, you know, and, you know, where they started from to where, you know, they finished at, you know, I just want to, you know, send them all right, you know. Malik, what would, and I want to ask you about uh, Corn Elder. What have you learned from him? And he had that big play last year to end the yeah. Duke game or scored the, you know, touchdown. What, what's special about him? Urgency. Like, he don't take no plays off and just watching him do practice and, he don't take no plays off watching film. He's very urgent, and what he do is great. And just watching him, you become a better person. Has he helped you at all? Is it, does he teach you things? Yes. Well, he teach me. He teach me a lot. Well, staying square at the line basically is what he great at. Um, quick jamming, opening hips, and just breaking on routes and just studying film. Shaq, does it feel like? I mean, is it hard to believe? How quickly would you say your freshman year went? Yeah, I mean, actually, I was just talking with you know the other linebackers about it. The seasons went by so fast, you know, and like I said previously, you know, Coach Diaz he always tells us what's going to happen before it actually happens, and he's like, you want to get 12 games, you know, and they're going to go by like this. So, and it's actually happening. So, just the the fact that it's coming to a close, you know, I'm actually going to be a sophomore pretty soon. It's just it's just a crazy thought, but you know, you got to keep moving and keep progressing. All right, last hit, question. You haven't hit a freshman wall at all. And, and most guys in their first year, you know, they get to about the middle of the season and they've had it. But, you know, there really hasn't been a noticeable change in, in your play. Well, why do you think that is? Well, I'm around a group of great guys from the guys behind me to the guys in front of me. And you put that together with the great coaching staff that we have. And I have no reason to let up. You know, we, we push each other to do everything right and to to be the best defense we can be because we have the talent to do it. And now we have the coaches that put us in the positions to do it. So there's no slowing down. You know, we want to be great. We want to bring Miami back to where it was. And, you know, reaching that standard again is our number one goal. All right. Thanks, everyone. Thanks, guys. Bye, Jamal.